Okay, we're driving out here to uh, empty out the fish death bucket, and it's uh, quite a bit calm out here. Pretty calm. this inlet here and to Government Island. I already dumped them, so I got to stay away from all these rocks. This Garmin helps me do that because it tells me the depths of the water all throughout. And you can see we're way the heck out here. Not very far, but we'll be able to go around that island. And here's a uh, house in here. It's pretty well interesting. We're going to fish for some perch out on the other side of Government Island, which is over there. We picked up a green buoy out here. I'm going that entrance there. I'm going to get around this green buoy because there's a reef out here. Well, we're going to do some fishing. We had to tow a girl in that got stranded out there in her boat. And we found her out there off Government Island. She was working out and she was paddling her boat in. So we gave her a ride over here to her house with this guy here. Over here on the Island. Hey, Dad. That's from That's Island. That's LaSalle. That's Coriel Island. Coriel. Okay, yeah. Coriel. Hey, Dad. Really nice. I really like it. Yeah. <laughs> Michael just reeled in a huge bass. Look at that thing. Bass in here. Hold that thing up. You can put your finger in his mouth and he won't hurt you because he's a bass. Small mouth. He was fishing for a little perch and he landed that big monster. Look at that thing. Can we keep it? Let's put it in the live well. We need to measure it. Now we're trying to find some perch here. Got the Garmin going here. Marking some fish. And uh, back here around Government Island, that's not Government Island over there, but we're somewhere out here within a bunch of islands. And uh, trying to find a weed bed. I think we'll find one around the corner here. Me and Claire are going to go back in the house. She's all wet though, so I'm not real eager for her to come in the house. I keep telling her to stay out because it's everything wet. JD's still got a fever. He jumped in the lake earlier and got real. Got a lot of chills on him, so he's not going to um, be swimming in the water too much until he starts feeling better. I did buy this little fish cleaning station that I'm going to assemble later on. A little portable fish cleaning when we start catching fish. I'll clean them back here behind the house. I'm going to walk back here in the woods here and check on, try to find a grill. Diane said there was a grill back here behind the house. This is the back of the house as we're on the island here. So we'll walk back here to this little shed. You can kind of venture, there's a lot of trails back through here, but 
they don't go very far and it gets pretty dense back here so there's a little shed right here with some wood and then back there is just thick woods I need to keep an eye on Claire so I think in this shed will be the grill I located the Weber grill and hauled it out here getting ready to put some coals on there and get fired up and have some burgers Jenny's fixing some sides in here Let's see what's going on. Got the burgers on the grill. There they are. Claire's wanting a burger, but she's not going to get one. She's got her dog food to eat. Mm -mm. There's a cottage back over here for sale. That's the boathouse to it. And it's just a couple rows down from Diane's place, a couple doors down. So we're going to walk down the woods and look at it. Walking through a trail through the woods over here on Marquette Island to view this cottage for sale. And there's a nice breeze. Cooper's barefooted here. Bother. There it is, a little cottage in the woods. It's got an upstairs and a porch and a nice little boathouse out here. Let's check this out. Got a boathouse out here. Brand new flotation dock boathouse. As you can see, Dollar Island is over there. There's a jet ski. And the mainland is right across the way here. There's Michael out there swimming. He's playing in the rocks. I go swimming. Now wait, JD. <coughs> and then over there's Dad's old place, the boat dock and the new structure they've built. Alright, we're gonna walk up the way here. We're gonna go up through here and check out this house, this little cabin. Kind of an old rustic cottage. And we'll see what this is all about. It's pretty neat looking, but probably needs a lot of work. It's definitely just a cottage in the woods. Boy, I thought I saw a little person in there, but oh, it's it's a little doll sitting on the chair in there. <laughs> I thought it was a real person. There's a little doll sitting over there. See it? You see the little doll? I've got some old furniture in here. And an old fireplace. <laughs> 